You got Beyonce in the background. Well, all right, all <laughs> right, all right. We are at North Myrtle Beach's Barefoot Landing. We're going to take you on a walking tour here. We're starting off right here at Flying Fish, which is some really good seafood. We ate there, I think it was about a year ago, year and mm -hmm. a half ago. It was really good. enjoyed it. But it's kind of a little bit on the older side, on the inside, but it's still yet some really good food. And then we're going to look at River City Cafe right here. So it's actually one of the best burgers you can get in town. They've got about seven locations, I believe. Ooh, and don't forget the peanuts. Peanuts, I gotta get those peanuts while you're in there. Always a good place to actually get some peanuts and uh, while you're waiting on your burgers to come out. But yes, it's a really good hamburger. Probably one of the best cheese, I think it's the best cheeseburger in town, actually, for the money. Uh, a lot of people will disagree with me on that and say Hamburger Joe's is. <laughs> but I'm not a uh, Hamburger Joe's kind of guy, just, uh, didn't do anything for me but we have a new building down here and we're going to go down here and check it out all right so we've got something new here at barefoot landing and it's been a while we knew something was going to go in here eventually but this is the big chill and they've got a sign up over here let's go check the sign out it's going to be on the right hand side of taco mundo but big chill island house coming soon Check this out. Wow, they've got some interpretations here of it. There's oh, your, wow. There's your back. Uh, I guess that's going to be the front be really side. That pretty, is like beautiful. like a greenhouse. That is beautiful. But, oh my gosh, if they get that to looking like that. There's the, I guess that's the back side of it here. It's going to be on the waterway, so you can set out back. Look at the tile. Look at the floats they got up there, oh, honey. Oh, it's gonna be so pretty. They got those nice fishing floats, the glass fishing mm -hmm. floats. All right, so what we got here? As the warm breeze blows, enjoy life a little slow and let the good times flow. A unique hospitality house designed to connect to the intercoastal and great outdoors. A casual year-round rooftop offering dining outdoor terraces, the treehouse lounge, and the best views in Barefoot Landing. Indoor dining that is cozy and welcoming. A broad seafood heavy menu that pulls culinary inspirations from islands around the globe. A refreshing, refreshing respite. Respite. Respite for boaters to dock and find a libation. Libation. <laughs> at our dockside patio so let's walk around and we'll see uh see what they've got finished out back out here but wow that looks really good doesn't it honey yes i can't wait to try that yes well uh, definitely keep you have to keep an eye on that especially for since the it's openings. heavy seafood keep an eye on the openings for that so uh let me know when it's going to open up and that way there i can come up for that so uh, actually, I'm thinking about changing the China, uh, the channel's name, China. Here's Taco Mundo, some really good uh, Mexican Americana food here. Got some really good views now. I mean, the views. Oh, they got that beautiful life. Oh my gosh, look at the top it's like of this that atrium up there. Yes, look at the top of that. That's going to wow. be so gorgeous. And your views of the uh, marina back here the walkway now they've got this fence so you can't use the walkway but uh me being my redneck self here i'm gonna uh, i'm gonna go off off campus here we'll take a look at the back of it here from the construction side of it But check this back of this place out. Got this big deck on the back side. Wow, is this gonna be nice. Look at the deck. Got that big oak tree back here in the back. Got like an atrium up top. I'm gonna have a lot of outdoor de decking back here. That's gonna be nice. But yeah. Uh, so there is the atrium up on top. Looks like a big greenhouse, doesn't it? Yes, it does. I like the way that looks. Well, from that ren rendering, they were showing like a greenhouse on the front, but I don't see a space for it. So maybe they'll have some of that greenery up there inside of the restaurant. Wow. It's going to be a, I think that's going to be a lot of seating up there also. You yes. Got, that's going to be all seating up top up there. Yeah, it's year-round uh, rooftop. Year-round rooftop bar on the intercoastal waterway. 
and that will be your views here. Which so I the love big this view. chill. This is probably uh, one of the best views in Myrtle Beach, I think, is back here. But yeah, if you uh, eating at Taco Mundo, you have this little outdoor seating area here, which is really good. But there you have your view of Barefoot Marina. There is the Barefoot Princess. We've always talked about going out on her, but we never have yet. One of these days we will. Just so many things to do. Well, it's uh, even more difficult now. I know. For us. You just have to get more focused. Yes. Gotta stay focused, honey. Laser Gotta focus. Gotta stay focused. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna walk down on this backside. Well, yeah, we're gonna walk on this backside. Here's the uh, Lulu's Beach Arcade. There's the, uh, I, guess I, I guess you call it's that a, a rope. rope sky trail. trail here for the kids to play in. You got a nice, got a real nice beach volleyball area here with sand for the kids to play in, burn off some energy. I already got a kid out there already. But what views here. But we're going to walk down, we'll walk all the way down to Greg Norman's in the and back then and then come, come back, back around come hammock. back around in front of the uh, come hammock. back in front of Lulu's and then over to Crooked Hammock and around that way see if there's anything else new here but yeah the big chill I am uh, wow I'm excited for that I mean that's the best thing about living here at the beach is there's probably 2,000 there's probably 2,000 restaurants on the Grand Strand which is great I mean it is just restaurant heaven if you can't find something to eat there's something wrong on the with Grand you. Strand you definitely have something wrong for you now some of them aren't always the uh, the best best in the world but there is a lot to choose from I tell you the uh, that barbecue oh man Whew. wow that makes me want to go to Paris Island again just to try out some of that barbecue. He's from down Beaufort, South Carolina. He had some good Carolina barbecue there. But Lulu's, fun food and music. And you got Greg Norman's here. And actually, uh, we'll walk out back here. Yeah, there's, this is a good old This is standby. the mainstay. This is the main, mainstay of a Barefoot Lane. <laughs> A man stay. Yeah, man stay. A man stay. Yeah. This is a, a tried and true, tested, been here since Barefoot Landing was Pretty initially much. put in. Probably one 30 of the. Years. Yeah, probably one of the only original, maybe three more original restaurants that are still here at Barefoot when they initially put it in. Uh, we've eaten here. Multiple more times. multiple times over the last four or five years than we have before i mean they need to do some work there that sign definitely needs some attention yeah, well it's been here a while so but it does need a little refurbish there's your uh, walkway all the way back up towards the big chill but greg norman's good steaks good atmosphere always very good consistent service very consistent Mm -hmm. Now the uh, Greg Norman Australian Grill and Shark Pub. All right, so we're going to uh, jump around the front here real quick, and then go back in front of Lulu's. Got some people already waiting to go in and have brunch today. Get their mimosas. Get their mimosas in here. But we'll walk over here in front of Lulu's, show you the front of Lulu's. Won't be eating today at Lulu's. Gina was letting me know that the uh, Surfside Pier is finally open. So we're gonna head down to Surfside too today. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get yeah, all this in. Action packed. 
action pack Saturday and I still haven't seen my son and his girlfriend Drew and, and their new and our new fur grandbaby and, yeah new fur grandbaby yeah need to see need to see him or is it a her him it's him okay what's the name again Elfie Elfie yes Elfie what a good name I like Elfie but got Lulu's here fine food and music really good really good I enjoy it really enjoy it I'm gonna go in here real quick show you the inside seating here got this nice big bar over here you got a lot of seating out back and then uh, let's head over towards the crooked hammock what we got what you got honey if Easter egg if you're gosh. here for Easter so if you're here for Easter, you can do the Easter egg dash up here from 12 to 2, Easter Sunday, March 31st. We'll be having a Sunday brunch at Islands at Universal's Royal Pacific. Royal Pacific, yes. So uh, got this nice little walkway over and the uh, looked it up last night, the first fireworks that they're actually having at Broadway at the beach is going to be March 30th. So that will be that Saturday night. That, so Right before Easter Sunday. Yeah. So if they're having them there on Saturday, they might be having them here on Friday. So if you're going to be down here for Easter for a little spring getaway, you know your fireworks are going to be on Easter Saturday night before Easter so uh, go down there and watch the fireworks get up at six o'clock do your Easter morning sunrise service on the beach and have a great holiday while you're here so this is the crooked hammock which is uh, really good we enjoy the crooked hammock it's inspired us in a few different few different ways with our backyard <laughs> retreat backyard retreat and our pool deck but yes it's very I love the way they've got those flowers hanging in there from the hanging pots I don't think they're real no but it looks good got some kids out here playing got the uh, Tortuga Island got a video on it which was fun but I never got to sit in the swing never got to sit in the swing yet because they're always, always the first chairs to be taken. Always taken. Always taken. But yes, you've got nice, really nice area back here for uh, waiting, waiting for your table or just kind of hanging out, chilling out. And dog friendly. Dog friendly, yes. Very dog friendly here. The little brewery is over on the other side, so if you want to take a tour of the little brewery, you can. Uh, doesn't look like there's anything in that building now. It looks like that's empty. But you got uh, popcorn here. You got Candle Company, River Street Suites. You got this nice little play at ground out here. This astral turf makes it makes it so good. Got your little train here that goes around. Don't forget the carousel. Got the carousel here, which has got some really. I, I mean, I love the tigers. Love the tigers and the rabbits up there. And got, got a little, what is that, a llama? Giraffe? Looks like a, a deer. Got the tiger there. Such a great little carousel. Got a panda bear. Got a little panda. Got the beach house here. Maybe the alligator might be out. There's usually an alligator that kind of hangs out back here in the back, back well, here. Not yet, but it's nice and warm. But he's not out. You'll see him right here sometimes. He likes to bask. Yeah, he'll bask on that bank there. I bet he'll be out today at some point in time. Oh, and then you always got Michael Myers. <laughs> Where did that come from? <laughs> what? It's Michael Myers. I couldn't even say anything. You got You're Michael speechless. Myers. Michael Myers is up here walking around. <laughs> 
You oh just never gosh. know who you'll run you into. You got no idea who you're going to run into at Barefoot Landing. <laughs> <laughs> it's not oh even my Halloween. Gosh. That was just like, I didn't know what to say. You got black at market minerals here. Now you've got Umberto's. Now have we ever ate and eaten in Umberto's? A long time it's been ago. We back ate when in they here. first opened yeah. up, maybe? Yeah. When they first opened like Bid Bar, 90, Barefoot Landing? 94. Gosh, that was a long time ago. <laughs> that, that's 30 years ago. I know. We're See, old. there's so many restaurants to choose from. It's just hard to, to okay, get them all people. in. I mean, if you if you take you four years. It would take four years to go around and eat at every restaurant. Bully's Pub and Grill's been forever since we've been in there. But, yep. now see, now this is kind of be what I would be expecting right here. Not Michael Myers. Right. I mean. Build a bear. Build a bear. You got to build, build a bear a bunny. here. Build All right. A bunny. How are you doing today? Oh, it's a bunny. That's a bunny. It's an Easter, honey. Easter bunny. Gosh, for Build a Bear. Oh, so I did. Did y'all just put this in? Is this new? We've been one year in March. One year. So they're celebrating. Not March, January. I'm sorry. Celebrating one year and January. three months. Yeah, January three months. the 17th. We opened. So uh, yeah, y'all was thinking uh, build a bear down at Broadway at the <laughs> beach. So now you've got to build a bear here at Barefoot. At Barefoot. Good job. So great to know that you all are here. So thank everybody's you, going you. to know now. Everybody's going to know. We've got California pizza here. She got her one look. She's got bunny ears in her. Oh my bunny. gosh, she's already been in there. Yeah. Oh my. Build a bear bunny rabbit. Build a bear bunny rabbit. That's great. Build a bunny. Build a bunny. All right, so uh, doing a little series here. Ooh, they got already crowded. They got a long wait list for. Blueberry Grill. Blueberry Grill, one of the finest restaurants for breakfast in Myrtle Beach, North Myrtle Beach, is right here. Is uh, Blueberry's Grill, one of our top, one of our top five, maybe yeah, definitely top five, top five places to have breakfast. With their little Blueberry signature Grill. blueberry cornbread. Got the Christmas mouse here. Young's Pecans and Gifts. You get a little coffee bar on the side there. Got that nice little outdoor fireplace at it. But let's walk over here towards the, uh, I think it's a new land shark, right? Yeah. It's the new land shark over here. We'll see what's going on over here. See what's new over here. Toy Kingdom. There's the pecan place again. Heaven's Marketplace. We went in there before. It was nice. It was Wax and Beyond Candle Gallery. The Soul Color Change shirts. And then you have this nice little area out here. The, pir the, the pirate, pirate ship. The pirate ship. You got a pirate ship out here at Land Sharks. Let's see here what all we have. Got some chests out here. This is uh, this has actually grown quite a bit since uh, since we ate here. I mean, they had all this back here, but the pirate ship was here before. They were kind of just finishing but, it up yeah all this stuff out here wasn't here but you have your uh fins up surfboards over here got a nice little bar out back i'll have to uh good thing about this i can edit this music out later on but here's your fins up logo and your nice little outdoor bar seating area here We've enjoyed that. We ate, we actually had dinner out here. Yeah, out there in that corner. In that corner here. Mm -hmm. It was really good. Really good. So, uh, but yes. Fins up. Land Shark. That barefoot landing. Really good. Uh, pretty good food. Pretty good food. Margaritaville. 
Land good shark. food, good times, good, huh? Good food, good times. That's it. Let's see, we'll walk over here and then go over to go over to uh, Ron John's. Monkeys, we are sweets. Now they've done a lot of uh, refreshment, refreshing up up here. Got something new going in here. They've tore it all the yeah. way down to the decking. Major construction. I've never been so upset with myself after I listened to that Portofino video. You got oh hung up gosh, on one tagline. Oh my gosh, I got hung up. Line. I got hung up and couldn't get off of it. I am so sorry about that. But it's just. Uh, shooting off the hip the way I shoot off the hip of my videos. I don't script anything. I just do it. I just do it and run my mouth. Probably a little bit too much. But here is Ron John's. The largest non-surf <laughs> shop on the East Coast. Doing good, how are you gentlemen today? Ah, right, so uh, we're going to walk across this little bridge here. Got all this pollen. Look at the pollen. Pollinators. Pollen Look at all the pollen. Woo. Wow. Went through this about three weeks ago down in Florida. Oh, there's the backside. Oh, wow, they had a they fire. Wow, they had a fire. Woo, they're going to change all that Man. Ah, uh, that's... That's horrible looking. I saw where that... Uh, one uh, model's house caught on fire in California, burned all the way to the ground. But we'll go over here towards you the. Uh, I digress back to uh, what is this? Wings. I can't think of the name. Wild of it. wings. Wild wings. Wild wings. Pretty good. Pretty. Oh, it's some decent. Helicopters. Some decent. Uh, some CH-46 Chinooks flying in here. Look at them. I've only flew on those a couple of times. The, the flying anvils, what we used to call them. I wonder where they're going to here. 80. That's how you get the uh, get gay rate. Well, they might be dropping some Haitians off here. I don't know. Joe Biden. I guess I'll have to digress again. But yes, barefoot landing at its finest. Me, uh, We'll get out here a little bit farther and we'll do a, uh, we'll zoom out and do a panning shot here. Look the way that, that bird's got his bird's wings spread out. Bird's got its wings out. spread out, drying out, I guess. Maybe something wrong with it. I don't no, know. No, I don't think anything wrong. It might be just showing kinda, off, too. Kind of got them all spread out. <laughs> all right, I got, must have said something bad there. But here you go. And to line up the turtles adjacent to them getting sun. There's your Ron Johns right here. We'll start off and do a panning. There's your land shark. Then you get back to where you're looking over towards the carousel. You got bullies right here on the end there. Kind of to the left of the water tower. You've got your carousel. You got your crooked hammock. You got Lulu's and Greg Norman's right in front of you there. Now they do the fireworks, they do the fireworks right out there in front of Lulu's, I think. It's pretty much where they shoot them off from. But yes, you can set up here and get a really good view of them. Depending on where the wind's blowing is where I would be at because uh, they don't shoot them up very high, so it does get a little smoky out here. Same thing at Broadway, you want to get somewhere want to make sure you get somewhere that the wind won't be blowing the smoke and stuff back on you. Well, see the turtles too? Yeah. You've got turtles yeah. in the seagrass Let's too. See, uh, it's a lot of turtles next that, to him. There's that bird we were talking about. Some turtles behind him. Mm-hmm, a whole lineup. There's about, I don't know, 15 of them? Yeah. And then you've got a cluster of turtles in the grass over here. But yeah, I don't know if something's wrong with that bird or not. No, there's nothing wrong with but him. There is some gators in here now. You gotta be careful. 
there is some gators in this pond. He's just getting some sun. So uh, don't feed the gators. There's your turtles. Ah, right, see, I hear all them birds. Oh wow, spring is sprung. Yeah, see, here you go. Caution, alligators and snakes in this area. Do not feed the wildlife. Ew, copperhead. Yeah, water moccasins. Little walkway over to Wild Wing. Got Alligator Adventure House of Blues, Dick Slash Resort, and Wild Wing Cafe that way, Harbor Walk Village, and Low Country Village. Kind of forget that they have each of, each of these areas themed out. Well, it's always changing with the stores and the new construction too. Yeah, they, uh, this area here has been redone. I think it was about four years ago they redone this area here. They did get rid of uh, the... Uh, alligator. Uh, not the alligator, but the tiger. Tiger, yep. Tiger. I can't even think of what he's... Uh, what he is down here. They used to have a spot down here. Doc Antle. Doc Antles, yep. Yeah, Doc Antles, Tiger Adventure. Adventure. Yeah, whatever it is. Yeah. But yes, Earthbound Trading Company. Adrian's favorite. Illusions. The crab. <laughs> Illusions replicas. Tiki gems. Gifts that tickle you. And then uh, you got a sign here for Land Shark. Got Blue Moon Trading Company. Down here, there's a uh, got a nice little walkway there, bridge going the over. Savannah Bee Company. Yeah. Savannah Bee. You can Bee. get you some mead. Yeah, get you some mead. Drink you some mead. Blue Moon Trading Company here. My cup, tumblers, and mugs. Quiet Storm Coastal Outfitters. Got one of those down at the Broadway at the beach also. No problem. Have a look. Silver Shack, Costa, Designer Sunglasses, Ooh, Designer Sunglasses, Tasting Room here, you got wine tasting here, seven for six dollars, that must be a tasting, a sampler. tasting a lot of uh, Boone's Farm. No. <laughs> Beef jerky, Myrtle Beach, it's sugar. Now here's the, uh, that's new. What? Where was Doc's at? Doc's was back here? Was Doc's back it here? It was like right in here. Or was it, okay, it was right here. Okay, this is where Doc's is at, okay. So they have completely- Ripped him out. Ripped him out here. There is nothing left of that. Well, he's- And here's the Savannah Bee Company, Gina, we went in there and had some really good, really good stuff in there. She uh, tasted some of the mead there and it was uh, actually pretty good. So, uh, got a little ice cream shop down here on the uh, left corner there. We'll walk down there. In a puppy place, faux pas dog shop. Okay, always gotta have a place to get your uh, puppy wear at. Gotta have a place to get your puppy wear. Bandanas and bowls and leashes. Yeah. Kentucky Mist Distillery. Do then you have a uh, whiskey Holly's, sampler. Molly's Creamery here. And then you have your uh, Crooked Hammock Amphitheater. <laughs> Seating wherever you can find a seat at. Wherever you can find a seat out here. And they got the seats back here. You see the seats right out here in front of me here. You get here early enough. On you can pick a spot. You pick out a spot. Some uh, really bad fertilization going on out here. I got some stripes. Stripes going on. But okay, so you got the uh, barefoot landing on the waterway here. So that's really nice. All right, so I'm gonna end this video right where we started it at pretty much, right here in front of the big chill. So uh, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe. We'll see you on the flip side. Stay frosty and remember, 
Barefoot Landing's calling your name.